Hi, I'm Alex from Mike's Dive Store, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the brand new Apex Mini Lunar Torch. Let's start off by taking a look at the box. Apex are definitely one of the brands that are leading the market in terms of reducing the waste in their packaging, uh, and the Lunar Mini is no exception. So it comes with this uh, recycled card sleeve, there's no additional plastic packaging, and the torch is in this reusable EVA case. Let's take a look inside the box. So the sleeve comes off. And there we go. So inside we've got a wrist lanyard, USB charger, some instructions here, and hopefully the torch. And there we go. Uh, it's in orange there, which is handy for all you raid divers out there. As well as orange, the torch also comes in three other colours, grey, green and purple and Apex fans will notice that that matches up very nicely with the lifeline spools. The charging of this torch is definitely one of the really um, fantastic unique things about this which I just want to show you. So on the back here you can see uh, that there are these two pins and what this means is that it's possible to charge the torch without actually having to open up the case and that of course drastically reduces the chance of any accidental flooding. The Luna is made in Britain. Its body is made of marine grade aluminium uh, and it features a single LED light at the front uh, which offers up to a thousand lumens of power. Uh, that goes across three different power settings. Apex also have something in this that they're calling uh, the Intelligent Thermal Management System and what that does is it lowers the power of the torch uh, when the LEDs exceed their maximum operating temperature. And what that means is that you can use the torch for non-diving purposes as well. Uh, so for example, you could use it to search the car park for an hour for your car keys, uh, only to discover them in your dry suit pocket. The Apex Mini Luna is not a cheap torch, um, but I personally believe it's one of the best uh, primary torches on the market now for a recreational diver. and It'll probably be the last torch you ever need to buy. From a technical diver's point of view, it also makes a fantastic backup torch because a backup torch needs to be a decent torch because if you need to use your backup, you need it to work. Um, and the sealed housing uh, and the quality of the beam here really fit the bill when it comes to a technical diving backup torch. It also has uh, a couple of holes on the back here for you to attach a swivel bolt snap to um, and they've even kind of smoothed the metal edges off as well so it's not going to cut through the line. To operate the torch, all you need to do is push this button on the back here twice. And what happens is that the torch comes on to the brightest level that the battery will allow. And you can see that the green LEDs there are showing that the battery is fully charged. If I want to change the power setting, I just push the button. So I can just push it once and I get the medium power which is shown as orange. And then it just reverts back to green to show that the battery is fully charged. And if I push it again, red power, uh, there is the lowest power setting. In terms of burn time, you get about one and a half hours on the full setting, uh, you get about three on the medium, and then up to six uh, on the lowest power setting, uh, which is definitely a great burn time for such a little torch. And finally, it even has a little SOS mode as well. So all you need to do is uh, hold the button down while the torch is on for four seconds, and the torch will go into a, an SOS strobe mode, which you can see there. And finally, to turn the torch off, all I need to do is just hold the button down for one second. And the torch goes off. If we turn the Luna onto its highest power setting, what you'll see on the wall here is that it actually has a really decent hotspot right in the middle of the, of, the, uh, of the beam. And what the hotspot means is that the torch will really cut through the water. If we compare it to an older model of torch that isn't actually quite as powerful as this one, the thing that you'll really notice is as we move in here, the intensity of the hotspot on the apex is much brighter. And what this means is that when you're swimming along on a night dive, it doesn't really make any difference to what you're looking at directly in front of you, but should you need to attract your buddy's attention, it's going to be a lot easier uh, with a torch that has a decent hotspot like that to cut through the water and uh, get them to turn around and look at you. So all in all, the Apex Mini Luna, I think, is a fantastic little torch with some really great features. 
and well worth checking out.